Our Mike with a little pop jump served, targeting Arthur early on. Takes a good look and unloads upon. I think as this match progresses, finding that rhythm in his jump serve. Solid pass onto option, pulling the trigger early and setting their stall out for that option play. Ending that corner, looking like it's a defender, defender, side out battle here to start this first set. Sweet pass, opens up the space for himself and finds, oh, he misses, oh, but we get a net touch. Great first end for Qatar as Sharif comes in, setting in stall, stall out for the block, goes late. They've got the scoop. Vandro having tucked that shirt in, making sure that that's not going to get in the way again. Throws a lot of spin onto the play and puts Tijan to the floor. Sharif with the rescue. The peel and here for the put away for Brazil. As he would have liked it. Good take, taking Evandro to the floor, trying to disrupt his ribbon, but he finds it's the back of the back take. And you can see why, so much pace. Neck and neck, 7-7, seven, seven, second end switch. Ahmed, mindful serve, still targeting Arthur. Mixing up the attack line, going high off the hands of Sharif. Love Evandro there. Arthur, under pressure, opens it up, going through the middle. Sharif with the peel, almost gets its hand on, but Arthur, after a serve and back-to-back -back block, gets the trickle ball. Evandro tries to fake it, but puts the set up, and Arthur, finding the seam, puts it away for Brazil. Uh, Evandro, nice high hands. Corridor called, he delivered on the line, and Tijan trying to go in there late, but doesn't get the touch he's looking for. With that vision, no complaint there from Brazil either. Arthur relentlessly getting that first pass, and what a take! And I think that's what's so difficult game is that pass has to be so precise to create good opportunities for options. Evandro gets himself on the block table with a brilliant cross court block against the left. Or more attackers using that to get out of trouble. Ahmed mixing up. Evandro not having seen much of the service traffic. Oh my goodness me, and that's exactly why belting it down the line. Evandro looking to capitalize on the one point lead. Puts Dijan to the floor, but what a pass. And the little chip over Evandro. So huge. Arthur under a little bit more pressure, narrowed out down this side, and there's that trademark away from the body, heavy-handed swing to the cross. This is potentially their breakthrough tournament. This is the highest result they have had so far. Haven't managed to make that many Elite 16s. Looking to capitalize on it. Mariano with the scoop. Can Evandro rescue it? He's got the touch. There's an angle left open. They don't take the on-two. Evandro's back in. Oh, but they... Calm it down, and what a cut from Sharif, but Brazil raising the roof of the was one here in Montreal. Having won that brilliant rally, 16-16. Arthur Mariano with the baby line, well, the baby long line, shall we say. Could go either way, neck and neck. No daylight between these two. Arthur Mariano seeing most of the service traffic. There he is, but Ahmed, he's got the touch, but not being able to keep hold of it. And if Vandro just offloads on the ball deep into the corner, and Tijan, even though he's there, can't get the touch. But now it's time for Brazil to make the defense. Arthur's hiding behind Evandro, and Evandro with the block. Deceptive for Tijan. Sharif takes hold of the middle, making sure he's trying to take the pressure away from Ahmed, and that's a nice high baby. Ball box looks like the call from Arthur Mariano. Going heavy and hard, Ahmed keeps his window open, but goes into the jumping block of Evandro, and Brazil take the first set, 21-18. Going back, he's taken a little bit of a skip away from his trademark serve. Oh, what a touch from Arthur, but 
Brilliant balance there from Arthur, even though he doesn't get the dig. Impressive to just get a hand on that ball. Lovely lift and the on-to option. You could see it coming. Brazil starting well, going so hard with the serve from Evandro. Totally taken by Ahmed, but Evandro with the block and the sets. Arthur with the high line, but the turn and burn from Sharif to set that ball up. On that end line, let's see if he can do it again. And loading down the middle, and yes, he can, Card, in answer to your question. So much power. Tijon not able to scoop that one. Solid pass. Ahmed looking for the seam. Does he get the line? Yes, he does. I think you're absolutely right about the service pressure that Qatar have got to find in this game. But that's a quality take by Arthur. There's the baby line that you're looking for. And you can see Tijan, he's holding, he's trying to juke, but he has to stay. He has to honor. To that baby line for the kill. There's Arthur with his little skip. Beautiful pass by Tijan. Coming in high, but finds the top of the tape. Still coming back at Qatar. Tijan, they're relentless on the serve pressure at the moment. Arthur with the touch and the backhand from Evandro. He loves that one. Seven to six. And Arthur with that little skip. Looking to offload again on the serve. Sharif, though, rescues the middle. Out wide, fast to the pin. Does he get it? Yes, he tags the line. It was so close. Against this Brazilian team by tagging. Rescue's a difficult ball. It's a good peel from Shaharif. He saw the deceleration. Under pressure, bouncing up, taking the middle bay and opening up that poke back to the line. Sharif going wide again. Oh, and Arthur almost flying, but getting the touch, making his presence felt in the backcourt against... Definitely the good side on that far end and advantage for the team. Trying to serve into that wind. So coming back out after the Qatari timeout. 13 serving 10. Up one set to nil. Whether that was the serve that put them there or was it intentional, I think just to get a different look offensively. Arthur taking Ahmed through, he's so bouncy, gets up quick and goes for it. the high angle around Evandro. Not an easy feat. After that hammer from Evandro, they switch back to Arthur. It's high, it's through, and he goes for that baby line, and he is almost errorless. Evandro making Ahmed play, maybe looking for the on-two option, but he runs through the middle, and Evandro with the block, Qatar recycles. But Arthur with the onto option, but Sharif seeing it. 14 17 here. Guitar down. Good pass from Evandro. He's not for slowing down and he's coming to apologize. Absolutely buoyant. Taking a four point lead. 18 serving 14. Sharif takes that over from the middle. And he gets that crossbody shot down the line. Or turn a ball, get a dig. Tijon getting a dig here. I like that they're serving Arthur. Oh, there we go. Pitcher holding the cross court, selling the fake, jumping plus one for Qatar. 16 to 18. Can they drag it back one more? Evandro goes on two, but the net slows it down. Tijan coming in, going hard, but Arthur holding his ground. Oh, and he goes for the baby cross. He hasn't done that one yet. Focus, determined. They're never going to give up, but they've got a big defensive play to be found. Arthur, beautifully passed. Corridor is a call, and the late jump into the angle. He's so patient. Somehow getting this left hand on that cut shot. Unbelievable. Qatar looking to make another defense. Can they go one at a time? They're keeping it on Arthur. No second ball option. Comes in hard and heavy and takes the win for Brazil. This is a monumental moment for this Brazilian team. They have been battling it out in the qualifiers. This is only the second time as a team that they qualify for the main draw.